doorbell ring. Z's here. What's up, Z? Oh, man. That was a weird timing. Weird timing for a doorbell ring. 7.30. And the doorbell rings. It's the, it's the delivery man. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get this going. Okay, I think I got it. Hi, guys. Getting a foot of snow, says Z. What's up, Luke, John, Robert, Roy? Aloha. We're going to... We're going to get this one going quick because I don't know how much juice I've got. In my, I, I mean, I know how much, but I don't know how long it's going to last. I didn't really think we were going to do the break tonight, but it sold out quicker than I thought. So, I thought to myself, would these guys want to wait until tomorrow or would they just want to get it done now? Even though you're not prepared or ready for this at all. And the answer is they want to do it now. So here we are. We're going to crush some cards. Yes. Lots of snow. We've, oh wow, 12 to 18. I don't think we're getting hit like you guys are. I see it's just, just a little, little bit of snow. Little bit of snow. Just enough. I think I'm going to give it till about, I'm going to give it like five minutes and then we'll get rolling. But we don't even, see, we don't have to do the randomization. We don't have to do the printing and the running up and down the stairs. We don't have to do any of that. That saves mm, seven minutes. Saves about seven minutes. So we can just get rocking. Anthony V, what's up, man? We'll hang out. Yeah, like I said, man, this one sold out quicker than I thought it would. The last PYT was like a year ago that I did, I think. So I didn't know what to expect, but I think you guys like this. Maybe we'll have to do another one sometime. I don't know. It takes a lot longer on my end, but that's all right. Pile on in, pile on in, guys. We might as well get things soaking. The good luck soaking. Oh, look at that. Three good, wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, where'd my bracelets go? Did I put them away? I think I put them away. The good luck bracelets. Well, we'll just have to use the cards. I'll have to use the good luck cards this time, it's okay. It's not like they're not lucky now. Just hang them. Get them flat. The triple threat. Might have to replace Kluber though. I just don't have faith in him. Is there anybody handy that would be luckier? Ooh, that might be lucky. That's got to be lucky. Maybe if I put the torque on there, his gravy will drip down in and we'll find a nice torque sonato. I like it. Bracelets equal handcuff? No, no, no. Bracelets, lucky. Good luck. My championship bracelets. Got the spinning wheel of death on my screen. Are you guys still here? What's up, Charlie? Okay, good. I'm still here. Uh, 
All right, just another couple minutes and we'll get rolling with this. And it's, it's gonna be a little bit quicker of a pace because I'm worried that my phone's gonna die and the whole thing's just gonna just power right down. Is there a list? Yep. Double check it. I, it's just a hard copy. I could probably drop the link. Oh, you like that, Charlie? Good. Good. I'm glad you like that. I thought it was pretty strong myself. My daughter's playing a online video game right now, so I hope the connection's good. It, it looks like it is. It's going between 4,000 and 2,000. Usually that's, that's like the money zone. I'm going to give it a refresh over here. Okay. All right. We might be good. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to get it going. Let's do this. Good luck. Good luck, everybody. Box number one. Going to get the hook. Whoops. That was the slap noise, not the hook. What should the hook noise be? I don't know. Like, what noise does it, the bill? Whoosh. Whoosh. Oh, Grant loves the bill hook. Good, everybody does. It's the best thing. It's the best, one of the best gifts I've ever gotten. You know, who would have thought? I never asked for a bill hook. I open up my stocking, and there it is. Just this gigantic, like, machete with a bill hook on the end of it almost brought a tear to my eye <laughs> oh my gosh you know me so well mortal combat noises yeah all right yeah we're gonna scroll through this paper a little bit quicker I, i've gotta i've gotta get this break done before the phone dies jeff griswell shane drone oh back to back eh back to back that is a first for me. Got a Nick Gonzalez first. Go to the Pirates. And our sky blue Tyler Brown. Oh, look at We got a Brady McConnell sparkles in here, too. Unnumbered, but very cool. Very, very cool. Going to David. David R. And back to the paper. I hope everybody's having a good evening. Hope it's getting better now. It was probably just meh, and now it's like, yeah! That's how I picture it. Got a little bit of purple. Purple paper. Mason Wynn. Standworthy? Sure. What was that OC? What is this? Look at this over here. Can you see that? It's like a... It looks like a gold, but it's like the, the color of the stamp. Gold stamp. We'll say that that is some kind of an error card and worth $10,000. So it's the only one just like it in existence. Got a refractor Nico for the Rays and a refractor Riley Green. That's pretty cool. Got the Nick Lofton. And we've got a Franchise Futures, Ed Howard and Burl. Going to Nick. Not getting much. How's it going, Sydney? Not getting much snow, uh, just a little bit. Then again, that could change probably by the next time I look out the door. But to start the stream up, like right when I loaded the stream up, the doorbell rang. 
and the dog started barking. So I just looked outside and it wasn't that bad. Beautiful Bobby. Going to David R. Nice, David. Nice little Bobby Witt Jr. refractor. Got that Ronnie Mauricio. Going to Nick. Another refractor. Oh, and a purple. Purple chrome first. Auto, Luke Little. 222 out of 250. Sweet. Going to Nick T. I like that. Lots of color. Man, our autos. Have we not? I mean, a lot of color autos out of this stuff. That's good. Another Bobby Witt Jr. glimpse of greatness. Ooh, two packs deep. We already got two perps. Oh yeah, they got autos. Grant, they got three autos. Each one of these boxes have three autos and we've been pulling color like crazy. Oh, that is sick. I love, it. oh man, that's sick. The refractor, even though it's just a refractor, it looks really nice. It's got a little scratch there, but. Zach Veen refractor first. Going to Adam Goldstein. What's up, Adam? Adam got some good teams today. That is stand worthy, I think. I'm sure Adam would agree. At least for now. We'll see how many. Just get them set up perfectly. So we're gonna need some room in this one. Got the Xavier Warren refractor. And the Nick Gonzalez, 20 and 20. Adam agrees. Flying through the paper, I see a Bobby. Burl. <laughs> Corey Lee refractor. Oh, the Pawson refractor. Sneaky little sneaky going to Tony. Usually when I'm thinking about getting a team, I'm just thinking about the, the firsts. Forgot Pawson was even in here as a prospect. And there's the Heston glimpses of greatness. Forty watching, eight likes. I don't understand that. Maybe you guys can help me out. Figure that out. Got a sky blue. Come on, baby. Let's get a good one. Sky blue paper. In. Drohan. I think I'm going to do the paper stuff all on one stand, maybe. Kind of like that. Overlap it a little bit. Another Zamora. I think, did we already get a refractor of his? Going to the Brew Crew. Another one, Priester. And the bits go 20 and 20. There's a Torkelson paper. Nice job with the likes, you guys. Didn't want to have to make the slap noise. Actually, I did want to have to do that because I kind of like making that noise. Heston, first, paper. And some refra another Pawson refractor, okay. It's gonna be that kind of box, I think, guys. Some, some strange collation, multiple doubles already. And the guy that I forgot to look up, Jordan Nogu. Which one's silent to enter the W? Still don't know. Probably should have taken the time to look it up. But I forgot. I forgot there's some crazy names in here.
Oh, come on. Can't have it crooked. Can't disrespect him with a crooked card. The Franchise Futures with Nick Gonzalez. Austin Hendrick. And Pete Crow Paper. Well, that's good to hear, Sydney. Tap dancing for likes. And we got some refractors. Owen Casey. Going to San Diego. Robert. Tink. Another possum. Lots of possums. Zamora and the Ashby. Applied pressure. Those are kind of cool. I like them. I'd like to see some parallels, though. If there are such things to, of the applied pressure. And Gonzalez. Back to the paper. We find ourselves. Let's get to the good stuff. Tyler Freeman Refractor. Alec Thomas Refractor. Going to Brandon K. And some chrome, 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 chrome. And, okay, here's a good one. Sky Blue. The Sky Blues. I really like the Sky Blues. They're underrated. Ben Hernandez. Going to David R. A Royals hit. 41st overall pick. And franchise Futures with Asa. Applied pressure color autos are the rarest in the set. Good to know. It's unfortunate that they're the rarest, but they probably don't hold the most value, even though they're the rarest. That was one of the things that took me a while to figure out that it doesn't always matter how rare it is. As far as value goes. A blue paper. Tink! The blue tink paper. 11 of 150. Going to Mark. So we got a purple, a sky blue, and a true blue paper. The Petey, Petey Halpin refractor. Pat Crab, what's happening? Yeah, Royals, they should be, they're kind of. I don't know, would you say, yeah, they're ahead of the Tigers, I would say, but they're kind of right in the same boat. They're both kind of developing their, their young guys in a different way. There's a Torkelson, speaking of the Tigers. Tigers already got their pitching, high pitching draft picks. I don't know a ton about the Royals farm system, but I know they've stunk for a while and have some, I mean, they got Bobby Witt coming up, and then they got Asa as a top prospect. So, you got some top guys. They're kind of spreading it out a little bit differently, which is good. You know, pitcher, hitter, investing, not, not putting all your eggs in one position basket. Alexander Canario, refractor. Brian K, what's up? The three autos were all on the top, really. Alec Thomas. Another Alec Thomas refractor? Is that too? And we got another sparkle in here. This has been a good box. This has been a really good box. Let's see what we can pull back here. What's this sparkle all about? Well, one of these are going to be the auto, I think, right? Hopefully. You never have two just regular nice inserts in a row. Caden Polkovich. And hopefully this is the auto. This is a blue. Sky blue. He's got a bat in his hand. It is Hayden Cantrell, 133 out of 150. The Blue Wave Auto, going to the Brewers, John. Nice pull, John. John Stone.
Kind of a cool auto. Little smiley face in there. Let's get the glare off. Yeah, those waves are hot. This is a great box. I mean, no, like, huge... The Zach Veen's a big, a big hit, but... As far as the autos, nothing huge that I really know of, but... What is this? 151st. It's just tough to say. You never know. That's the beauty of Bowman. The you never know factor. Freddy Zamora. Another... Refractor. There's a big one. The Max Meyer Refractor. Marlins. Top boy. Three overall. Refractor. Beautiful. Yeah, that's to 150. Um, what, 13, 113 out of 150. Uh, I kind of feel like putting it on a stand. It's worthy. Pete Crow. Chrome first. And the franchise futures with Zach Veen on there. There's a Dominguez. Okay, box number one. Box number two. Cool, Dave. Good to see you in here, man. Come hang out, learn a thing or two. I'm all about sharing the knowledge, spreading it around, building the community. Helping people make informed decisions i'm working on that best of the year spreadsheet too guys so i'll be making a video about that as soon as i'm done and the thing of it is is i just keep wanting to add statistics or numbers i want to keep adding numbers to the spreadsheet and it makes my formula bigger because i figure the bigger the form the bigger the formula like the more variables that i have in it the more accurate it'll be Although it's, there, there, is a, there is quite a bit of subjectivity in it because I have to assign things grades, but I'm trying to use numbers to do that. I'll show you. Yeah, these are from the most recent draft. They're first, these are these guys' first official Bowman cards and they're some of the most valuable cards that you can have. If you get a top, like, let's look at today's players, you know, Acuna or Tatis or some, some of the stars, some of the studs, Cody Bellinger, Mookie Betts, something like that. You get these guys, their first cards, especially when they have an auto on there, autograph, who they can be very expensive. Jimmy G. Bitcoin is just based on consumer confidence, I would say. But I don't know anything. Don't go with what I say. Landon. It's kind of like our whole economy, though. You just keep pumping money into it, and it's all good until the collapse. Louis G. There's the Heston. So we've got... All of our inserts are good. So far. Yeah, Strikers Investment Counseling. Where our slogan is, I have no idea. Don't listen to me. I'm just a knucklehead. Got some green paper. Yeah, yeah. Brian Kay's right on. Zach Britton. The green to 99. 30 of 99. Going to the Blue Jays. Brian A. 
that is one of the more centered paper color paper parallels I've seen a lot of them are OC I've noticed oh look at this we got a Jason Dominguez refractor going to Adam excellent Throw that up there for fun. Looking at the chrome and the Max Meyer. The inserts continue. The good inserts continue. I prefer to buy low. Cedar. I'm more of a buy low, sell high kind of guy than a buy high, lose everything kind of guy. Bobby Witt Jr. There's the Adley refractor. Yeah, a little bit of scratching going on. Tyler Brown refractor. Oh, sorry, hold on. Can you put in a UPC of one of those boxes? I'm reading your thing, Mark. I just saw it. Can you put in a UPC of one of those boxes and pack wrapper so you can try to send that whole Yeah, I yeah, I can do that for sure. And there's our auto, Gage Workman. For the Detroit Tigers, Daniel T. Williams. Congratulations, my friend. Tigers are good in here. There's lots of, lots of Tigers autos. And of course, the top player. <laughs> 300,000 Emerson Hancock it's another good one Seattle number 6 overall for the franchise futures we're getting all the best ones Jason Dominguez did you mean 30? There's a Heston first paper. Let's keep going with the good luck. That'd have been sweet if that was a Torkelson. Zach Deloach, Jordan Adams, couple of refractors. Nick York. We got Jesse Franklin, first refractor, going to Joshua. Swaggerty. And a sky blue. Zach Daniels. Going to James. Cool card. And the franchise futures, Angels. Let's read Detmer. What is he? Yeah, he was 10th overall. Read Detmer's 10th overall. So it's, it's continuing. There's a Torkelson first paper.
yeah that, that that little sky blue number is very nice got another purple paper who should it be Bobby Miller 58 out of 250 going to Luke There's Nick Lodolo, top pitcher of last, the last draft, and an upside down Julio Rodriguez. Hmm, does that mean we got something good coming? I don't know. I hope so. I hope that means there's something really nice in here. Well, there's the Torkelson first. That'll have to do. Oh, look at that. Back to back, the glimpses of greatness and the straight up first. I like that. Chrome Torkelson for 60 today. It's a good price. Of course, it depends on a lot of factors. Gotta hope it's not scratched. Centered. A lot of variance between the high and the low. Here we go, J Groom. Casey Schmidt. Oh, I see some sparkles back there. That's good. Is it looking like there you get once? One out of 27, so around that. Looks like one of these is probably gonna have an auto on it. Which one's it gonna be? Okay, so the Andrew Vaughn purple chrome. Going to James, nice, and I think this is gonna be an auto, you guys. Oh, it's the, oh, sweet, Ace Lacy. Oh, yeah. Look at that, number four overall pick. Going to David, that is a beautiful card. Look at that, on card auto, 37 to 71. That's nice, whoo. Look at that thing sparkle. Oh yeah. Got four packs left. Yeah, I love the sparkles. Yeah, that's a, that's a it's a real gem, a real gem, not like one of those fake fake gems that you make in the factory. Matthew Liberatore, refractor. Got the Belazovic. Applied pressure. There's a Riley Green. Glimpses of greatness. Tigers. And the paper. Manny picked up an Ed Howard chrome today. I'm going to wait till I get some eBay bucks, like a bonus eBay bucks thing, and then I'm going to buy some cards some Bowman first cards singles I think they're pretty expensive I think right now is a seller's market for this stuff see they all seem quite expensive you got to kind of wait with this stuff like with the Bowman 
Bowman stuff in particular, they'll they'll die down. The prices will die down after the initial, oh my gosh, this is the first cards of these guys. They, they start selling like crazy left and right. Here's the Robert Hassel. Couple of scratches, unfortunately. Patrick Bailey, it's a big one. He was 13th overall. Oh, look at this. The Robert Hassel 20 and 20. That's some kind of a refractor. Yeah, that's numbered to 250. That's cool. I like that a lot. That's a cool card. I think that's stand worthy, as a matter of fact. I'm glad they did that. Added parallels to the inserts. Got a sky blue paper. It's Nick Swiney. See, a lot of the paper is OC. We'll have to remember, keep an eye on that. So we've got Adam Seminaris, the first. Another Jimmy G refractor. Here's the Emerson Hancock. Chrome, Austin Hendrick Chrome. And the Max Meyer Franchise Futures. Another Dominguez paper. Way OC, yeah, the paper, most of the color. Most of the paper parallels are OC. I don't know if I've seen any that aren't. It's a Bobby Witt Jr. Okay, Helio Ramos. Justin Lang. Both refractors. Got a Jordan Walker, Pete Crow refractor. Or no, I'm sorry. Chrome. I'm looking at this blue back here. It's got my attention. It's beautiful blue. It's a blue wave. It's Alaric Solar Solari. Alaric Solari. It's got that's gotta be it, right? Cool. Another blue wave auto. Man, we're two for two. One's going to Ryan. Congrats on that. That looks good, too. Yeah, that looks nice. The darker the blue, the better the card, yeah. Yep, I tend to agree. But all the blues are pretty cool looking. Even the light, like those little sky blue chromes, those look really cool too. All right, box number three. It looks like we're going to make it. I haven't gotten a message from my phone saying, I'm going to die soon. You better do something about that. It's plugged in though. It's just... I need a new phone. It dies on me. Even when it's plugged in doing this, it'll die. So it's got to be like really charged up before I start. Last box. Good luck, everybody. It's been good so far. Lots of color autos. Look at that. We've got... Where's that other one? Yeah, four out of six. Four out of six color autos. 
You think the collation is blue wave, blue wave super fractor? I love it. I would love to, I'd love to see it. I love where your head's at. Let's keep it, let's keep that whole feeling. We'll keep it present here as we open. Justin Foscu. It's a nice refractor. We've gotten a, we've gotten a good refractor out of every box too. Like a, like a really nice name. And a purple in the first box, purple refractor. It is Francisco Alvarez. Francisco. So lots of color, lots of color autos so far. Another Dominguez paper. What do we have here? It looks like there's a blue paper hiding here. Get to that first. It is Hayden Cantrell. Followed up by the Dylan Dingler refractor. Werner Blakely refractor for the Angels. And the Tigers franchise futures with Torkelson and Dingler. Dingler's going to be really good. I hope so. Cool, there's a Riley Green. Is that the second Riley Green refractor we've pulled too? I think it might be. And our first auto is Werner Blakely, another color auto. It's a refractor, 220 out of 499. Going to the Angels, Brian K. So what do you guys think of this format, the Pick Your Team? Cool for every once in a while, do it more often, don't do it again. What, what, are, you, what are you thinking? I need feedback. Torkelson. Robert, good. Every once in a while, yeah, that's what I was thinking. I think it's better I don't know. Yeah, it's probably better for Bowman stuff than regular releases. Yeah, most people like it random. Yeah, prices are different for each team. Got a Daxton Fulton first refractor. Isaiah Green first refractor. There's the Robert Hassel, 20 and 20. Yeah, mo I mean, most of them are gonna be random, but every once in a while, every once in a while we'll do this. Just cause, you know, people like their team. People have their team. And if you really want it, you can have it. If you get there. Austin Wells refractor plus that today I gave notification of like earlier than I listed it just so you guys had a little bit extra time to figure out like what maybe what team you wanted to get Ryan Jensen 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 Bryson Scott stop I always call I always say Bryson Scott but it's Stott Sky Blue Chrome, 
Thomas Segesi. Segesi. I really got to do some work on these guys. Wow, that's OC. Whew. I got to go all the way to the fifth round, learning people's names. Sagasi. It's got to be Sagasi. You kept hitting refresh. Wound up with Detroit. Nice. Yeah, the variety, the the mixers. I like doing the mixers too. This will probably be the last straight up Bowman we do, at least for a while. There may be some kind of Bowman mixer in the future. I, what I really want to do is do Bowman through the years, but that gets super expensive when people start to make it from different releases. The price just blows up. Nick Gonzalez, green first paper 87 of 99 it's a pretty nice one seventh overall pick right there see what i mean about the oc though all the paper nick york and hans kraus refractors pete crow man I think almost every Pete Crow I've seen has had some damage to it too. A little bit of scratching. Hopefully it comes right off. It's just a smudge or something. Is that first green? Yeah, that was a Nick Gonzalez first. Green paper. If that's what you're talking about. I went to the Tops website yesterday because I, I have a bunch of orders through them. There's that 70s, I can't remember, Super 70s collection that's coming out. I ordered some other different little sets and some other things that I'm waiting on. The Montgomery Club has a couple of different things. I, I got the soccer cards through the Montgomery Club, the Sapphire, and also the Garbage Pail Kids cards, which I don't like, but I just sold them. Logan Gilbert, and they blocked me. Said I was some, you know, there's a list of reasons why it can be blocked. I didn't violate any of them. It's like, are you a bot? Like, no, I didn't even hit refresh a bunch of times. But luckily today it was it was good again. Tyler Soderstrom. There's our regular auto. So we've gotten one of these regular autos per box. Man, if it if it goes that rate, where two out of every three of them are color, holy cow. Hopefully it does. Probably not Steel City. But that would be nice. And the Angels with Reed Detmers. Well, they added more autos in general, so they've got more color, too. So maybe there's maybe there's just less base autos and more color autos. Like the, the the ratio is different. I mean, but they added more guys to the checklist of autos. So I don't know. You got two thirds from your box. Caleb, these cards go... Everybody bought their own team. So you could go in and buy the, the Oakland A's. You get all the Oakland A's cards that we pull out of here. Or whatever team you got. Sometimes we do a... Ran, most of the time we do a random. So you get a random team. And you'll get all those cards. Dylan Dingler Refractor. Reese Hines. There's a Torkelson. All right. So we got at least two of these, right? Or was it three? Alec Burleson. 
Yeah, it's a pick your team break. There's the Marco Luciano. Glimpses of greatness. Two chrome, two paper, okay. Got three packs left after this, guys. Tanner Burns Refractor. Owen Miller Refractor. And there's the franchise futures for the Padres. With Hassel and Lang on there. Well, thanks, Sang. I agree. The next one's going to be cool. Well, one of the next ones, when I do the best of the year, we'll be doing all the best releases of the year. There will definitely be Bowman. There will definitely be Topps Chrome. That I know for sure. Brandon Fett. Fett, such a weird name. So many silent letters in there. Well, this paper's not too bad. That's probably the most centered one yet, eh? Oh, look at this. Another Zach Veen refractor. Very fortunate for Adam. Yeah, Robert, Topps Big League was good good this year. Should I add that in? Maybe I should. Maybe I should. I, I didn't put it on the on the list, but I I don't know, man. Marco R Marco Araya. The the ceiling isn't there, and I I'm pretty sure it wouldn't make the top ten list. And I, I'm already on. 17 different releases in my spreadsheet trying to figure out what the best ones are i'm already at 17. i wanted to stop at seven i wanted to stop at 10 maybe 11 and then i was like oh yeah what about this what about this oh yeah what about that one and i just kept adding them and it's getting ridiculous to the point every single one additional one i add that's another huge row of things i have to figure out about it i have to draw the line somewhere Heston, and I don't think, dude, Big League can't make the top 10 list. That'd be blasphemy. People wouldn't take my list seriously. Even though everybody, I think, agrees with what you say, what you said there. Big League is, and is, is a nice release. It was the best in, in years. Ethan Hankins. Owen Miller, that one's quite a bit OC there. Robert Hassel, first. Patrick Bailey, first. Oh, we got another one of these. Another Refractor 2020. That's interesting. 135 out of 250 for the Reed Detmers. For Brian K. Let's, let's let these guys share a stand. And up next, we've got the black auto. So yeah, guys, two out of three color. Daniel Cabrera for the Tigers. 18 out of 75. Look at that. Stars and stripes, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Especially the dollar per auto. Dollar per auto slash dollar per hit. I've, I've added a bunch of categories this year because last year I didn't have dollar per hit. It was just dollar per auto, I think. Or maybe it was dollar per hit and not dollar per auto. There's another Torkelson paper. But it just keeps going and going and going. There's no, like last year there were a few runaway products as far as value. This year I'm not really seeing a runaway product. The, 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 since the price on everything went up, 
And I'm just using hobby. I'm just using hobby. I'm not using jumbos in the equation or retail. Gotta, you know, gotta find a point that we can use for everything. The, o the only thing is I am like the Bowman mega boxes. I am using that retail because that's the only that's the only way and also the sapphire you know that's like a almost like a mega box i suppose you would call that hobby but it, it seems like a mega box yeah ben baller's on the in the spreadsheet for sure i just i don't know the answer to anything yet because i haven't i have not completed like so the the spreadsheet just say it's like this long with like 20 different cells I'm probably like 15, 15 deep, but I've got some, the, the most important stuff coming after. So I have no idea. I'm just looking at the numbers right now. Nick York, Trevor Halver first, both first refractors. Gross hands. Got that Emerson Hancock first. So we've gotten a few of those. Austin Hendrick, same thing. In the franchise futures, Max Myers, Dax Fulton. Yeah, I love all the color. I'm afraid I'm gonna be biased because I like so much I like color so much. But I'm gonna that's the whole point is I'm trying to keep the bias out of it and just use numbers. Alright guys, let's see what we got. Lots of color. Look at all this color paper. Look how fun that is. Uh, that guy, Nick Gonzalez, Hayden Cantrell, Nick Swiney, Bobby Miller, Zach Britton, Tink Hentz, Shane Drohan, and Mason Wynn. Good amount of paper, color. What's it looking to? Okay, so it's three paper color per jumbo. Looks like, looks, looks to be. Let's check out the autos. Luke Little. So right off the bat, we got some color. Luke Little, purple. Oh yeah, we got a couple of these Zach Veen refractors. Good day for the Rockies. We got the Jordan first auto. I'm just going to keep it to Jordan. And avoid that last name like the plague. Hayden Cantrell to 150. That's a sick one. I like that a lot. Also, the Max Meyer refractor is a good one. The Francisco Alvarez purple chrome. Alaric Solari blue wave. We got two of these refractor inserts. The Robert Hassel and Reed Detmers, two good ones. The Asa Lacey sparkles to 71. It might not take that long, John. You'd be surprised, man. These guys start popping up a little sooner than you might think. Gage Workman Auto. Jason Dominguez Refractor. Like, uh, Shirt and Apostle had his Bowman first card last year, and he played last year. So that it does happen. Daniel Cabrera got the black auto to 75. Tyler Solderstrom. Probably the Lacey, I'd, I'd have to say. But I don't know. Someone could probably look it up real quick. These prices, early prices, you never know about them, though. Werner Blakely. But, I mean, that, that should be a card that's worth it. A few hundred dollars should be. I mean, my my straight up Casey Mize auto. Where is it at? What did I do with that thing? I don't know what I did with it, but that was like I think seventy or eighty just for the regular auto. So that one should be a few, I mean, a couple hundred dollars, 250, complete guess, complete guess. 350 maybe, 450, I have no clue. He's a high pick, man. Four, number four overall. 
beautiful card though. Went 3 0 with a .75 ERA and four starts. Fanned 46 and 24 innings pitch, 8 and 4, the 213 as a sophomore. Fastball up to 98. There we go. He's got the slider already, too. Change up and curve. Okay, yeah, yeah. Nicknamed Ace. Well, for good reason. Lacey Enmeyer. Asa. Ace. What a unique and original name. Ace. All right, guys, we did it. 400 asking on eBay. Okay, yep. It's right around, right around what I thought. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, maybe we'll do one more this week, guys, if you guys really want to. Um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking of doing like a potpourri type break where there's a bunch of different stuff in it, with no, maybe no no particular theme, just kind of like uh, some some different things to try to spread those teams out a little bit more too. So there's more opportunity and potential something with some hall of famers in there potential for like hall of, Fa hall of famer autos. So we can spread the teams out. Maybe some Bowman type stuff and tops going back a couple years, throw some Chrome in there, something like that. Yeah. Multiple years going back multiple years, even. The only problem is, is last year's stuff is really expensive, but we can do that. I do have a little bit of last year's stuff hanging around. Yeah, I think we will. I've got, I've got an idea. So probably Friday, guys. Keep your eyes opened and your ears peeled for that notification for the slammers. I'm gonna put a. I'm gonna drop that link up here. I forgot to do that. Drop the slammer link. Hopefully it stays the whole time. I don't know if it will. Pin it to the top. To become a slammer. There we go. Pinned. All right, guys. This was fun. Thanks for watching. I will catch you all later.